What's up guys, Michael here. In this video I want to focus specifically on all resets available to your Kindle Paperwhite 11 generation. The steps in this video would be particularly helpful when your Kindle is freezing or glitching, possibly not powering on at all, or you're getting blank or black screen. Let's get started. Before we jump to the content of this video, I'd like to talk to you about Kindle Unlimited. Kindle Unlimited is a service that allows you to read as much as you want, choosing from over 1 million titles and thousands of audiobooks. A lot of the books also have audible version, so you can switch seamlessly from reading to listening. I'd like to share a link with you that will get you a 30-day free trial for Kindle Unlimited. You can always cancel it on the 29th day and won't get charged, but you will have plenty of time to explore new titles and see what's available. If you're interested, head to the description or the link banner in the top right. Before we even apply the resets, I'd always recommend to check the battery first and make sure your Kindle is charging. You should see the amber light when charging and green light once fully charged. If you don't see any light, check the connection, possibly try another cable or check your plug and possibly try charging via PC or laptop. Once the device is charging, it's time for some resets. The soft reset is the least invasive way to fix your Kindle, as it won't remove any of your books or settings. To perform soft reset, simply hold the power button for 30 to 40 seconds. You may see the screen flashing, which is completely fine. You will then see Kindle logo with the progress bar. That's when you can let go of the button. Allow one minute for the device to finish the restart and test the device to see if the issue is fixed. If the issue persists, it's time for a hard reset, also known as factory reset. Factory reset removes all your personal data and downloaded content, returning the device to its original factory settings. It will also deregister your device from Amazon account, so you will need to re-log in and re-register back again once the process is finished. To perform factor reset, simply turn on your Kindle, select three dots at the top right and go to settings. Once in settings, press on the three dots and choose reset option. Agree to remove all your downloaded content and select yes. The process may take a couple of minutes, so stay patient and let the device do its thing. Once done, you should end up on the welcome screen. Now, what if none of the above steps works? This may indicate some hardware issue, however, I would still recommend that you plug your device to the charging station, let it charge for a couple of minutes, and perform both resets while the device is charging. This would be especially useful when you end up with unresponsive device. If the device is still under warranty, I'd recommend that you contact Amazon support and see what repair options are available for you. I hope that with those steps you manage to fix your Kindle. If that's the case, please share your experience in the comments down below. I'd also appreciate liking this video and subscribing to the channel. We have loads of great content on Kindle device that you may find useful. Talk to you in the next one.